Welding operators use highly technical welding processes that can create dangerous conditions in the workplace. Both oxyacetylene and electric arc welding can pose safety and health hazards for welders and workers nearby. Exposure to these hazards can result in discomfort, temporary or permanent physical injury, or even death. But welding can be safe if you protect yourself from the dangers. You owe it to yourself and your fellow workers to find out what the hazards are, evaluate their presence in your work environment, and learn how to control them. The first step to safe welding is to know about the hazards you may come up against. Every welding process has potential hazards that are always present. Some are obvious, some are not. Let's take a look at some of these hazards now. The intense light rays emitted from an electric arc are ultraviolet and infrared. Excessive exposure to ultraviolet rays from welding flashes can cause permanent damage to the eyes and, in extreme cases, blindness. Excessive exposure to infrared rays can cause burning of the skin. Arc flash, also known as welder's flash or arc eye, is one of the most common and serious risks to a welder. It is a painful ocular condition sometimes experienced by welders who have failed to use adequate eye protection. Short-term symptoms can include extreme eye pain, usually described as a feeling of having sand in the eyes, headaches, migraines, and nausea. Long-term exposure to the radiant energy emitted from an electric arc can cause skin cancers, cataracts, and burns to the retina of the eye. The intense radiant light associated with oxyacetylene welding and cutting operations can cause eye strain and burns to the skin. Temperature extremes are caused by the welding process, welded materials, the work environment, and the weather.